Last time we took Amtrak's inaugural second train from Alexandria to Rono. Now we have 48 hours and we're gonna do some exploring. And we like beer. And we are gonna try and find a lot of different kinds of it. So stick around for our beercation and see all of the places that we stop on our brewery tour. Roanoke has six breweries, all located about one mile from each other. These breweries are a part of the Virginia Blue Ridge Cheers Trail, which is a collection of wineries, breweries, and distilleries. The Cheers Trail Passport has a list of all of the breweries in the area, and if you check into at least five of them, you get a free t-shirt. First stop on the trail is Three Notch Brewing Company, and this is actually one of the only places on the trail that actually serves food in-house. To me, what really stands out about this place is you get some pretty hefty flights for $8. I got the Big Slice IPA, Floyd Festival, Prototype Habanero, and everything in its right place. I got the Ghost APA, the 40 Mile IPA, the Minuteman New England IPA, and the Watermelon Goes. Really like That's the watermelon. But this is how I play the game. And I'm not doing it afraid. Oh, 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 let me show you how I do it. All day, all night. I do it big. Live in the life. Although this is a beer tour video, we're gonna talk about food when it's good. And the food here is pretty darn good. Here's the food we ate. Sarah got a bacon cheeseburger with fries, and I got the mama said cluck you out chicken sandwich with tots. You can't miss Big Lick in Roanoke, and that's because of the beer garden and the huge mural that's painted on the side right behind me. This is one of the nicest points you ever got. It was all neat and organized, good handwriting. <laughs> It tastes like when you end an Otter Pop and it's just the juicy syrup at the bottom. That's what it tastes like. Just think, having that one and then having that one afterwards is not good. It's like a lightning strike. We also ate at Beamer's next to Big Lick, but we talked about that in our last Roanoke video, so we'll speed through that here. Taking a break from all the beer, we decided to hit the river. down this river, we are thrilled to let you know that this video is actually sponsored by Visit Virginia's Blue Ridge. The Blue Ridge Mountains provide loads of activities, whether you're an outdoor enthusiast or a foodie and beer drinker like us. And the best part is, it's super easy to get to via Amtrak, so you can take in some of those scenic views without having to worry about focusing on the road. Amtrak Virginia offers amazing discounts along the Northeast Regional Line, including the Anytime Fair, which gives you 15% off within Virginia and DC. Our favorite place to stay is the Liberty Trust, which is a beautiful boutique hotel located right downtown. Head to visitvbr.com or click the link in our description to plan your visit and download discounts for local restaurants and attractions. Okay, back to the river. I see you dancing, Rosalina, Lita. I'm at your window tonight. So we just finished up on the river and it was a lot of fun. But now we're gonna change, go out, get some food, and get some beers. You set my heart on fire. Golden Cactus is the next stop on the trail. Now that I think about it, I walk the 
I loved Golden Cactus mostly because of the interior. Here was good too, but I mostly just like the vibes of that place. <laughs> Golden Cactus is a brewery that doesn't feel too like industrial stuffy. It has a really fun decor inside and it's a really cool just interior to enjoy some delicious brews. There wasn't a huge menu of selection, but I think everything we've tried was pretty good. Neither Big Lake or Golden Cactus have food, but you can get some decent tacos at Tuco's across the street. With three breweries down, we decided to take a break before getting back after it on day two. First stop, Old Salem. Old Salem might have had my favorite flight this entire trip. Here I got the Mountain Jam. Ooh, that's a very refreshing. Heartbroken in disrepair. Also very refreshing. <laughs> I picked good ones. Hip Hop is Dead. Swag surfing. Solid fight. I honestly don't remember what I got, but I think it was maybe the mother plucker that was my favorite here. Duo Goats is located in the west end of Roanoke and it's kind of easy to miss because it's connected to an apartment complex. The beers here are pretty good. For an 8 ounce pour, it only costs us $3, so it's pretty cheap too. And this is one spot that really goes all out for branding. Second trip to Roanoke is coming to an end. I feel like the city served us pretty well this time. Drank a lot of good beer, got a lot of sun, and of sun. I'm pretty excited to come back. Detour. Duo.